hello hello you are welcome to Yvonne Winifrey UG my beautiful people today as I'm standing here as you're seeing these beautiful cars I just want us to explore together so I'm standing around Victoria Mall and I just want us to move up to Imperial Mall but we are not going to use the main road I just want us to see how beautiful Entebbe looks like when it comes to the interior places. So, we are going to be passing uh, inside this side where you see these cars going to. And there is a lot of things that are really good to the eye and I want us to see together. So, let us go. And this fence that you see here, guys, is for the famous Victoria Mall. Victoria Mall is that one mall in Entebbe that is most occupied, like most busy, and like most visited. People are always here. Not very many, like on a daily, but I believe on a weekend. And this day is a Sunday, and I think you've seen the cars queuing to enter into the victoria mall gates you know like you find everything at victoria mall restaurants there is a hotel uh, like telecom services and they work even on sundays so like it is that place that are uh, where you can find anything that you want even supermarkets there's curry for so guys and also as i was going on as we are going on uh, you are seeing some beautiful apartments. I think you're seeing. Yes. So these are the botanical view apartments. And if you are a resident of this apartment, you're just going to be viewing the botanical gardens. Hence the name botanical view apartments. And even the botanical gardens is just near this place. Really near. So... That is the building. Uh, you just find furnished apartments, unfurnished apartments. And I'm just going to be showing you uh, their contact. Uh, if you are interested in the building or in the apartments, there you can just uh, contact them. And the beautiful thing is that the apartments are near Victoria Mall. They are near the road. Like they are easily accessible. And there is also this Arasus Aviation or Arasas Aviation in the same compound. This is how the apartments look like, like their face. And also you can screenshot these guys to get their number and to know more in case you are interested. I feel like it is a nice place to stay at. So guys, this is the face or the compound of the apartment. Yeah, that is the place. Botanical view apartment. There is even parking. So guys, after the apartments, as we continue on, we just find also the famous botanical gardens. So the botanical gardens are really great for agricultural studies. And if you just want to see different kinds of trees and plants, you just come at this place. If you just want to rest, they have green grass, beautiful gardens. And I think now it is managed by the government of Uganda. And so you have to pay. Even in the past, you you had to pay, but now I think it is really, really serious. And it is a huge place, very, very huge, but quiet and peaceful. If you just want to rest, I see many musicians coming to shoot their videos here. I see even content creators these days, they come here 
uh, like to shoot their videos the space is really huge so don't worry about you know the place being overpopulated you can always come and rest in that gardens so even as we are going on guys we are finding some motels some like restaurants like some simple and beautiful places that you can always come and visit test their food test their rooms like and enjoy and tell me because this place is really serene very quiet the tall trees i think give this place a great ambience so you can always stay here you can really really always stay here in in case you just you know occupy any of the hotels around this place or motels or like anything <laughs> or even if you just rent a house around this place so we're just going to be continuing this side and also as we go on guys this is uh, a snippet of the botanical gardens that is how beautiful the inside of the gardens look like i think you're realizing that we are outside like outside the fence so now guys here where we've reached uh, there are many pathways that connect back to the main road in Entebbe and that is one of them just opposite there and for us we are going to, to, to be going we are going this side what am I saying anyways I think you understand we are heading this side and up there as you continue you just uh, go back to the main road and that town up there is the Entebbe main town this is where we are from and we are heading this other side so this is where we are heading to and I think you're seeing the place is really like quiet you're not finding many people here and this is a Sunday but still there are like a few cars a few people even on weekly days you don't find many cars or many people around this area so guys let us continue up to where we are going but as we reach many other places i'm just going to be explaining more to be telling you more about the spaces or the places that we find on our way and one of them is this place guys like look at this beautiful flowers outside here uh, let me just get to the other side so that we see them very properly so from this other side first we are seeing this beautiful tall tree like it is really tall then down here these are the flowers so anyways trees are everywhere around this place i think maybe it's because of the botanical gardens or something else but anyways let us just continue to where we are going <laughs> And here, guys, we are seeing the Uganda National Health Research Organization. Yes, this is the building. That is the information about them, the little information about the, the place. And it is a white building. That is the place in Entebbe. And ahead of us, guys, that is also the National Agriculture Research Organization. So let us head to that side also and explore more.
And now, guys, we reach at the National Agricultural Research Organization, the Entebbe offices. And I think this is the headquarters in Uganda, but I'm not so certain. If you know, please inform us in the comment section. And also, guys, we're just going to follow this route also and get to the road that connects from Imperial Mall up to Uwek or Entebbe Zoo or even up to the lake. So now we're just going to follow this route. And as I was going, I found some guys cutting some logs. So I couldn't film that part or around that area just because for like for their privacy, guys. So we're just going to skip that and just continue our journey. <laughs> So we are this side now and guys this is where we've come from like down there that is where we've come from and let us continue up this side and then I will show you where we are going next. So this route connects back to the main road and that is where we're going to be going and down this way this connects to Uwek and down up to the lake. First we are going to be going up this side. The opposite one leads back to also the main road like there are very many different routes. So Imperial Botanical Beach is also down there. So, let us go to where we are supposed to go. And it is up this side. So, let us move. And we are going to be seeing more beautiful places. But before that, guys, check this beautiful house. I love the shades of grey. This is going to be a beautiful house here. Tall trees still. You are seeing many tall trees all around this area. And there are some houses that are being constructed also. I think you've seen uh, the buildings that are under construction. And even as we are going, you're going to be seeing a few. And by the way, guys, not every house is so beautiful or modern this side. And I heard there, guys, those are the imperial apartments the imperial mall apartment and some of the walls this side or the fences are really like old these are the houses that have been here for some time and for us we are heading this way so let us go And at this point, guys, we are seeing the Imperial Golf View Hotel, like the beautiful Imperial Golf View Hotel ahead. And also opposite it is the 
beautiful imperial mall building guys this is the place that really inspired me to shoot this video this area looks so beautiful very very beautiful and clean like very beautiful and clean are you seeing everything that i'm seeing are you seeing everything that i'm seeing it's like you're outside uganda i should say like this place is so serene very serene let us continue you're just going to be seeing like like guys this hotel is so beautiful i just love it I just love it. I just love the serenity around it. Inside, when you go inside there, the place is really beautiful. It's like you're outside Uganda, I should say again. It's like you are not in Uganda, guys. If somebody shoots a video or like <laughs> if somebody shows you a picture of themselves around this place, you might ask, why are you in Uganda? which place is this like this is not third world country it's not developing country it is really beautiful it is clean like the ambience is so fine it is very fine i think you're seeing what i'm telling you and also guys opposite the golf view hotel is the imperial mall building this place is also clean and great like it is really really great though guys it is just underrated if you're from imperial mall please you should advertise your place a little bit more like people only know about the victoria mall yes yet this place is so beautiful like this place is so beautiful though it is less occupied it is not all that busy yet it is very beautiful so let us enjoy as we continue on this journey So guys this is the huge and the beautiful imperial mall it is such a great and beautiful place and opposite there you find some craft shops and up there is the main road this is the main road so we've moved from victoria mall up to this beautiful imperial mall the state house is just opposite there it is just a beautiful place that is where we from down there this leads to the international airport and this leads you back to kampala and guys i think you've enjoyed this video tell me more what do you think about this place i'm sorry about the the i should say the video quality the the weather was not favoring me though this was the day that i had to shoot this video and even when we reach here guys we find this road so clean and beautiful this is the imperial mall guys this mall is so beautiful i think it is even better than victoria mall though this one is less occupied and if you're a business person out there and you want to like if you want some space why not come here like 
tab here <laughs> and just advertise more so that the people can know where you are beautiful road so entabe is really beautiful and i know guys uh you've enjoyed this video so go on and please like share it with anybody else and also tell me what you think about entebe or about this place that we've seen today and also tell me any more places that you want to see in entebe and i think i'll be seeing you soon bye